And we're almost out of time. You've brought some footage, and I want to warn our viewers, it is disturbing. So if you have a queasy stomach, come back in five minutes. We only have about a minute left. Uh, tell me what you've brought now and why this disturbing footage is uh, interesting to us. Uh, it's a very hard, um, hard uh, video to look at. Uh, I think we've blurred some of it out. Yes, it's uh, it documenting uh, slaughtering uh, of uh, a young uh, man, male, uh, and the reason... In which country? It, it was said it was in Tunisia. It and was why was he being because slaughtered? Because he, he converted to Christianity and he refused to... Uh, the, to adopt again, uh, to adopt Islam. And then you can hear, hear the, what they are saying, they blame Christianity, uh, curse Christianity, etc., et chant uh, Islamic uh, prayers and slogans. It, 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 for about a minute, they slaughter his... And this is interesting. They slaughter him like an animal, like, like, like an him. animal. Like a stuff it, film. Yes, and you know, it, it's, it, that, is, that was published this week, in, in the week that... We heard about the crime, uh, visible crime of uh, Luca Magnota. And you can see dozens, maybe hundreds of videos like that coming from, originating from Pakistan, from, from the Middle East, etc. And it's, it's, it's very regular to see such, uh, such, uh, such videos. And, you know, that brings us to understanding what, uh, where, come, where comes the, uh, this radical uh, Islam and it may infect, uh, affect also other, other countries. You know, that's a great point. The, our whole country was shocked by Luca Magnana and his film, and not just our country, but France and Germany also. Imagine if every week or every month there was another Luca Magnata doing it in the name of religion and boasting about it. That would coarsen and terrorize a society. I thank God I live in Canada where such barbarity is, a, is an extremely rare offense rather than regular politics. Thanks for bringing this to our attention.